sense at all that maybe some, a night like this was coming tonight at all? Did you get that feeling before tonight? Yeah, no, not really. You know, not really. We, um, I felt pretty good where we were, you know, throughout the day as much as, you know, it's been one of the hardest days, obviously, in Oklahoma State history. And, uh, you know, this morning was really tough. And uh, guys were, you know, you know, in the dumps a little bit. And I think, you know, I think we kind of took on the mindset to, you know, go out and play for those victims and, and uh, try to get a win for them. And, uh, you know, it was one of those deals tonight. You know, the ball didn't bounce our way at times, and they made more plays than we did, and we turned it over. And, and, and they did the things, that, you know, what it takes to win games. And, uh, but, you know, we didn't, we didn't have it. You know, we didn't see this one coming. They had an extra week, obviously, to prepare. Did they show you a lot of different stuff that they hadn't shown on tape? Not so much. You know, I mean, we, I knew everything they were doing. Um, it was one of those deals. They, uh, you know, we just, uh, you know, misfired on, on a lot of different deals. I mean, I think I, I, overall I threw the ball pretty well. We had um, a lot of guys open. Guys made big-time catches. Um, you know, two of the interceptions were tipped balls. You, you're just going straight from the air. I mean, those, those are things you really can't control, but they're still on me. As a quarterback, those are on me. I mean, I got to, you know, find a way to, you know, make a throw and, and avoid, you know, hands going here. I mean, it's just it's, it's part of playing quarterback. So, um, you know, I think uh, you know turnovers. You know, it always goes back to turnovers. You can't give them five more possessions than, than they uh, already have. So, they, 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 you know, I get I tip my hat. They came out played very hard. Um, you know, did some good things. You know, good things. East Minnesota just like I said, just played really hard. We knew that coming in. We knew they were going to play a lot of effort. Why do you think you had uh, su such a hard time running the football? I don't know. Without seeing the tape, it's hard to tell. Um, you know, they're, they're always big and they put a lot of guys in the box and, and um, you know, trying to make it one-dimensional. And, uh, you know, and, and I think, um, you know, whatever they did, like I said, without seeing the tape, it's really hard to say. But, uh, you know, you got, you got to be able to run the football. And, uh, you know, tonight was, you know, kind of sporadic. And, and uh, we'll learn from it. We'll get better. And we'll, uh, we'll bounce back. Just as a leader, how do you pick these guys back up from this? Well, you know, tonight it's going to stink. I mean, we got, you know, got a long trip back to – Heck, Des Moines, and then you got to fly home. So tonight's going to sting. I, mean, I think it's all about how our uh, our attitude on Sunday, how we go about it on Sunday, and and uh, I mean, if, here's the deal. I mean, as much as it stings right now, there's nothing we can do about it, you know. And, and I mean, that's that's kind of the approach you have to take. You know, you got to learn from it. These are the games you, you really do learn a lot from, and um, you know, it's going to be my job as as kind of the leader and the uh, the voice of, of this team to you know be positive, you know, take the positive stuff and run with it, and, and uh, you know, continue to you know. Guys, you know, really good players. You know, we got great players on this team. We, we got a good thing going. You know, we just had a little bump in the road, so it's, uh, it's all about how we bounce back.